man. Gang, what it do, man? It's Monday. I see where we at. Wow, well, Mark. Folk. Y'all know on Monday is the grocery shop, gang. Like, no cap. Like I told y'all on last. On last. I told y'all on yesterday, vlog, man. I think I pulled the muscle in my glute. I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna take an ice bath tonight, though. Like, for real, bro. Like, something got to give, man. I might just have to go to the doctor. I don't know. I think this, I think this all was right here, y'all. Hold on. Like, she look like she don't want to do this shit. Uh, green. They look like we had to move the neck, man. Shot time, yeah. Yeah, but anyway, that's what we got going on, okay? I'm gonna let y'all look at that, y'all. Do that thing. Be right back. Yeah, I'm back, gang. Anyway, Shawty really looked like she did not feel like doing that, bro. But, uh, like I was just telling y'all, man, uh, I don't know, man. I went the whole day at work, man, and my my hip i don't know if it's my it's not my hip i know what my hip feel like it's like my glute i think i strained my glute gang when i was uh squatting the other day man and i don't know like you know i got sore like a day and a half after so i was thinking i was just sore you know what i'm saying but it ain't went away honestly it got a little worse because i worked out friday like i told y'all but anyway uh, i'm gonna take an ice bath tonight man i'm gonna see if that ice bath help with the um inflammation because I think that's all it is. Like, inflammation has built up in my glue area. It's causing it to just hurt. It feels like irritated, man. I can't work out. Y'all know me, bro. I'm a I'm a fitness advocate, dog. Like, I love working out. Have y'all ever like sprained a muscle or pulled the muscle in your body, and that muscle basically work with everything? Like, I try to do some push-ups, right? And uh, I couldn't even do push-ups because my glute was hurt. And if you don't know what the glute muscle is, y'all know that's your ass muscle. You did. Hey, man, I don't even think I introduced myself, bro. Gang, what's cracking, man? If you're new to this channel, man, I go by Don. I got a beautiful wife. Her name is Quana, and this is our YouTube channel. Gang, go ahead and do me a huge favor. If you haven't, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ring the bell. Hit all. Become a part of the DQ family. And I need everybody to go ahead and like this video up. You feel me? Go on, like this video, man, because y'all know how we do it, man. But, yo, like I was saying, bro, like, I know I pulled some. I don't think it's nothing that bad. I don't think I broke nothing. Like, you can't break your ass, can you? You know what I'm saying? You probably can break your hip, but like, can you break your ass? Can you break a glute? You know what I'm saying? I don't know, but I know I pulled something because I feel it, bro. Like, and it feels worse, like, when I first sit down and when I get up. Y'all coming down below, you know, y'all ever had that problem? Like, when I first sit down and when I get up. And no, it's not my, what you think it is. Nah, it ain't got nothing to do with that. You know what I'm saying? It's a muscle, bro. You did know what I'm saying? And, I'm trying to bail with it, gang, because I don't like going to the doctor. I don't like taking meds, man. I've been popping ibuprofen like they candy, and I don't like doing that. And the ibuprofen, it helped me sleep, but it don't make me feel no better. So I don't even want to pop those. So one of my partners at work, he was like, bro, take an ice bath, bro. I'm thinking like, well, you might be right, because I tried to put some heat on it last night. That heat ain't did nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm thinking like an ice, a ice bath might do it, gang. So late on the night, man, I'm going to... Uh, Go get a couple of bags of ice, man, and take an ice bath, man. I've never done this before, and uh, I hope it don't send my body into, like, a shockwave, but I got to do something. Something got to give because I'm ready to get back in the gym, and I'm ready to just not feel this pain. It's so uncomfortable, bro. Like, it's not even a pain that I can't bear, even though I can bear, like, a lot of pain. Like, it's probably, it, it would be a 10 to you, but to me, it's more like a, a slick 6. You dig what I'm saying? Because I can bear with it. I can go with it, but... I just, I'm, I'm, I'm tired of it now, bro. I'm tired of not being able to take a nap. I'm tired of not being able to, you know what I'm saying? As soon as I get up, I feel it. When I sit down, I feel it. Might have to bite the bullet and go to the doctor, man. I'm going to keep y'all posted. Had to crank up a vliggy, man. Vliggy vlog. I ain't going to talk y'all, y'all, man. We're going to get to the crib. Wait on my moment to get off of work, man. And we're going to see what the day is going to bring. Once again, come and like, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you ring the bell. Hit all. Come a part of the game. Let's get it. Hey, so we back at the hot, man. I'm gonna show y'all what we got. First of all, I wanna show y'all these. My fries were open, bro. Corner gonna wanna take that back. Walmart, count your days, man. Count your days, man, for real, bro. Like, look at these fries, bro. Why these fries open, bro? Look at my fries, gang. Corner finna take them right back to them, just like that right there, bro. Bro, she got her grandma some flowers for her birthday card. Look at it, Cole. Walmart. Logan. Oh. 
Go. Going on here, man. Come here, Logan. What you happen for? But I thought I heard some upstairs, bro. I was finna, hey, I was finna say, hey, what's going on in this mug, man? Ghost me. But yeah, like I was saying, though, dog. Like, come on, bro. Look at these flowers, though, gang. Just look. Look, 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 Diego. Look at these flowers. What you think, Cole? Sit. Sit. See, he won't even sit for him, cuz. Walmart. <laughs> Count your days, man. Gang, gang, what it do? So, uh, right now, man, I'm on my way back to Walmart. Corn got some business he got at home, man. She's on a, basically a strict time schedule. I should have checked this stuff before I even left Walmart, man. But, yeah, she told me that she done had to take some stuff back before, and she told him about it, and they brought it right out what she all uh, wanted, man. So, I don't know. That, I, I don't know about these flowers. They can have these flowers, gang. You know what I'm saying? Because she's not going to have any use for the flowers. You know what I'm saying? Because she's about to basically... You know, she bought them for her grandma, man, and it's her grandma's birthday. So, like, I don't know, man. I don't know what she's going to do. I don't know how they're going to do it, but I'm going to tell them I only want the flowers. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm going to say. But he fried, though. They got exchange. He fried, cause Come on, man. But look at these cows, bro. i never seen them like this. Man. Like, look, man. I ain't like a herd, bro. I ain't never seen them herd like that. It's my first time ever seeing that ever. Yeah. Anyway. I'm gonna have some good steak. I'm gonna have some good steak. <laughs> I'm a I'm a God fearing American. I'm a God fearing Donald Trump voting steak eating American. That's why that's why I wear my bad pro hats. Cause I'm a God fearing Donald Trump voting steak eating American. <laughs> American. Bro, I know these folks at Walmart be mad at here, bro. Somebody did a pickup for a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I'm gonna pick up anything. Oh, like, I'm gonna pick up a bucket. Look at her. They be out there. Mercy, but they look at her. She's like, yeah, hey, hot, yeah. You motherfucker bought all these damn groceries. <laughs> then, I done came back. We returned some dead ass flour and some fried that were open, cuz. I wonder who in the brain mind that, cuz. Look at her. Look at her. She handling that vacuum cleaner, too, cuz. Them folk did pick up for a vacuum cleaner, boy. We some lazy and nothing's around here, boy. All right, gang, just a little check, right? I was gonna get some more flowers and try to basically, uh, Meet corner with the flowers. I don't know what corner that corner probably already on the road, but I was gonna try to basically meet her with them because she bought like a little vase too. Just to, you know what I'm saying? Give her grandma some flowers because her grandma, like, she she into that type of stuff. Like, her grandma probably could have grew them flowers. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, bro, we ain't finna buy no dead flowers. So basically, I just told them, give us a refund on the flowers, man. They just couldn't find a good batch. You know what I'm saying? They was like, even she looked at those and she was looking like, them motherfuckers dead as hell. I, I wish I could have got on camera. She was looking like, them flowers dead as hell. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, so even when I when I said I just get the refund, they were like, cool, because they all on probably did. Every every batch in there probably did. It's Walmart we talking about. This ain't Kroger. This ain't public. Walmart really don't care about no flower. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's cool. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. So, yeah, I'm going to just holler back at y'all when I get back to the crib game. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but these folks at Walmart, but I can't believe I, but I can't believe the ladies that got a vacuum clean. Went online and said, I'm going to get a vacuum Anyway, that's funny to me. That might not be funny to y'all, but we're gonna holler at y'all we get to the house, man. Let it go. Gang. It's cracked. So, we got corn with me right now. Who was that before, gang? We gonna watch Natalie get another award. How do you look like that? It, it seemed like we beat her since she was this high. <laughs> right. And we be at the same place. Every time. It don't even matter. What grade she in? We, we it here. We here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The day I asked, I said, what, what award you get? She don't even know what kind of award she get. She said, Nah, she don't. She said, yeah. no, she put the work in. If she's going to be rewarded for whatever, she's right for it. So, so what we got going on today, gang. So we finna watch our baby sister get this award. And we decided to bring you guys along with us, man. You did? Anyway, I make sure y'all come in like subscribe to the channel. Make sure you ring the bell. After you ring the bell, hit all join the gang. Nat, Nat, got Marley no award. Look at him. <laughs> Willie McDonald. Hey, look at Gang, what to do? So, I don't know what day this is of the vlog, gang. I'm just gonna say the next day. 
D, but right now, man, I'm in traffic. Just got my hair cut, man, you know what I'm saying? Getting ready for the weekend. I don't know what we doing this weekend. It is Mother's Day weekend, but I don't know what we doing. I know we're going to go down and holler at mom and dude, you know what I'm saying? Holler at my stepmom and, you know what I'm saying, do something with Corner's mom. But I don't know what we doing. I let Corner plan and all that, you know what I'm saying? But uh, it's a beautiful day today, man. You feel me? But y'all know I got to end the vlog, got to end the video. And I want to say I appreciate you guys for watching, man. I appreciate you guys for tuning in, gang. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't going to cap with y'all. I've been kind of inconsistent when it comes to the vlogs. You dig? I just been picking up the camera when I felt like it, man, and not when I needed to pick it up. Because I know a lot of people out there, man, y'all basically look to us to give y'all motivation to basically want to do something with y'all life or basically want to excel in your day or seize your day. So I apologize for that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to do better next week, but... That's water on the bridge, and like I tell y'all, we don't cry over spilled milk. Just go buy a couple more gallons of that shit, no cow, you did. But uh, anyway, before I end the video, I just want to say this. I've been watching the news lately, right? And I don't really watch the news, but lately, you know what I'm saying? When the news pop up on Corner Phone, she'll send me an article or whatever, and uh, I check it out, man. You feel me? Like, normally, I don't like watching the news because the news can be very depressing because there's so much crazy stuff going on in the world. So I normally like just don't, but lately I've been like, you know, checking out the articles that she sent me, man. And lately it's been a lot of young people who are basically dying. You know what I'm saying? A lot of young people who are dying to gun violence. You feel me? And I'm not gonna get up here and act like I'm one of those people who like, oh, we need to take the guns. Let's take the guns. Let's not nah, because honestly, and my dad always tell me, don't talk politics and don't talk religion on your platform. But I just want to say this: I'm not with taking the guns. You know what I'm saying? I ain't with that. And I'm going to leave that at that. But this is what I want to say to the young kings, man. The young jits. Especially the ones who follow me. Is being down. Like they'll say back in the day. Or being a real street N-I-G-G-A. Or being a gang member. Is that worth your life? You know what I'm saying? Is doing street activity actually worth your life? Think about that. You feel me? For all the young parents out there, man, you may have a kid that you can't get through to show them this video. I'd be his big brother. Because I want to see our young kings, our young black kings, I want to see you guys excel in life. In the whole gang, 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 and the whole I got my blicky, blicky, and the whole my op this, my op that. You're not going to excel. I know you guys are listening to Lil Durk and NBA Young Boy and, you know, all this other rap stuff i listen to it also but let me tell you something those guys are rich those guys have made it out of the slums they have made it out of the trenches man they talk that op stuff and i ain't gonna lie i think some of them probably have caught a couple bodies but they made it out and the thing about it is they ain't got away they still got an answer to the wrong things that they have done you did because it's a god who sits high and look low i ain't gonna preach to y'all you know what i'm saying I just want to tell my young just that, listen, gang, gang, and I'm street, and uh, I'm this, I'm that, that ain't worth nothing, you dig? Let me tell y'all something, man, growing up, I wanted to be that, I wanted to be street, I wanted to be a gang member, I wanted to be all that, and then I realized, them niggas broke, you know what I'm saying? I just had to realize, that. I had to realize, like, I'm pulling up in stuff that they wish they had. I'm living in something that they wish they could live in. I'm with a chick that they wish they could have, bro. You know what I'm saying? So that's all I want to say to y'all. It's not worth it, man. It's not worth it. So before you get ready to pull the trigger, before you get ready to rob somebody, before you get ready to break in that home, think about how your mom is going to feel if you laying face up and she having to bury you. Because... You done did something stupid and now you done lost your life. Or you done lost your life to senseless gun violence because you and another individual just couldn't talk it out like me. Y'all had to basically put your hands on one another and then guns are drawn and now somebody is dead. You know what I'm saying? Nothing is worth that, man. We got enough crazy stuff going on in life. So we ain't got time to be hating our brother, hating our sister for no reason. We got to come together, man. And like I said, I don't believe in let's take the guns and all these strict gun laws. I really don't believe in that because just like they got the right to bear arms, I got the right to bear arms. But we ain't going to get into that. I just want to tell the young kings, the young men, let's make better choices. Let's make better decisions, man, because 
once that time over, once your clock stop ticking, once you expire, you don't want the preacher to get up there and have to lie about you. You don't want the preacher to get up there and have to make something up about you. You want that preacher to be able to listen to everything everybody else had to say about you. Or you want that preacher to be able to know you himself and be like, you know what? That was a good man. That was a good human being right there. Because the thing about it is, none of us can cheat death. All of us have to go through it. All of us have to see it. But it's all about what you leave behind. And I want to be legendary. I want to leave a legacy. You dig? And I want you to do the same. Believe that. Now, hey, man. I'm going to crank up another video. So I might have the same thing on that I got on now, gang. But I'm just going to crank up another video. But I had to end this video. I want to say I appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe to the channel. It's Teacher Appreciation Week, man. So I got to see. What well, I'm finna get my mom for Teacher Appreciation Week. You know what I'm saying? I might just get her a couple of her favorite things. I got her a gift. I haven't showed y'all. I might put that together today and go ahead and give it to her. Though. Yeah. Anyway, man, I love y'all. Quanta love y'all. We're going to see y'all in the next one. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell. If you haven't, hit all. Become a part of the DQ family. We love y'all. Let's get it. Okay. Step on. Wake up, brother, gon' rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, you grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Yo, set your affirmations, aspirations. I got shit to do. The aftermath of preparation. Good food, good mood, blood in circulation. One step.